couple of big punts from you that were in huge moments there. I mean, kind of take us through those. Um, well, at that point of the game, you know, everything was so hectic because uh, the we we went into the I think we were transitioning to the fourth quarter, right? And you know, the momentum of the game was kind of it was at a standstill. Where like everything, you're not really sure where this is going to go. It could go our way, it could go their way, and you know, I have full confidence that it's going to be ours, but. Um, coach just said, you know, do what you did all fall camp, and I just did it. And I was like, <laughs> I don't know if you saw me, I was, I was fired up out there. I was like, <sighs> I was going kind of crazy. But, um, and then the second one, it was just kind of a routine thing. Cam basically just said, hey, just put the ball in my hand. I was like, all right, let's do it. And we just kind of went out there and did it. It seemed like on that first one, they, they, they got some pressure off the edge oh, in yeah. your face. Yeah, so I always take a, a little bit of a peek to see, you know, where they're at. And um, on that one, I was just, I went and just saw, I don't know how many, I think it was like three or four or something, but they were coming. And I just quickly just, you know, picked up and popped it. And then it, you, you know, on, on a situation like that, you can't really, it's 50-50 whether the bounce goes your way or not. And because half of the ball makes it go forward, the other half makes it go backwards the way it hits. Now, I was fortunate enough to where it, it smacked and it went backwards and sideways, and that was, I, I mean, I, that's all God. That's, that's God working right there. Coach Moorhead said he had a few suggestions for the special teams at halftime. Uh, <laughs> Did he kind of get you guys fired up going into the second half? Yeah, well, you know, he is, his speeches are always so, he gets so into it and so fired up about pretty much everything on special teams, defense, offense, and, um, he basically just said, "Well, at that point, I hadn't punted yet, so, and honestly, I, you know, coming in, I was, I was thinking I wasn't going to, you know, hit very many punts, if any." And uh, he, he said, "When he said something about when your time comes, you know, just be ready to go out there and be ready to go." And I was like, "All right." And you know, I was waiting. There's so many situations during the game where it was third and six, but our offense would get a first down. Third and eight, offense gets a first down, and I was sitting there warming up throughout the entire game, and then finally. Finally, I got you know a chance to go out there and hit one. And, uh, Talk about the momentum of this game as a whole. It seemed like you guys kind of had it, and, and just oh my like, gosh, I mean, yeah. you're never in danger of losing it. That was um, that was a, a roller coaster emotionally on the sidelines, you know, because you come out and you start the game the way we did, where offensively you score on a beautiful pass from Tommy to I think Osiris that just looked textbook. You really can't do much better than that. And then Cam Dancer gets a pick right right off the bat like that. You think. Oh, you know we're about to just steamroll over these guys, and and um, but then we face some uh, adversity, you know, right away with right after that when you know Tommy gets you know hit from the blind side and the ball comes out, and you know we had to battle you know a crazy momentum shift, especially you know we have a lot of young guys on the field, like a lot of young players and players who had played their first you know college football game today, and. Obviously, for them, this is a huge learning game, and for our coaches, they're having to, you know, really kind of do a, a little. I'm not going to say extra coaching, but essentially, you do have to coach them up a little bit extra because they don't have the experience, and you know, the jump between high school and college is crazy. So, uh, in a game like this, when the momentum is just going back and forth, and you're not really sure, every little thing matters, whether it be you know a pick or a sack, or a, you know, you make them have to punt or you punt. And, it was uh, it was just something that it's unpredictable. It's, that's the best word, best word for it. unpredictable. And then you know it paid off for us really, really well in the end. And that that was huge.